airport. I'm going around San Francisco doing stock signings, but more importantly, I'm going around San Francisco in the East Bay area eating things. Um, we are at Cafe Gratitude, where in order to order a salad, you just say, I am fulfilled, because that's what their salad is called. Say hey, Lizzie. Hi. Vegan place where my friend Tiffany got kicked out because they brought a birthday cake and it had wheat. What are you grateful for? I'm grateful for meat. You gotta love these Bay Area roses. They're past their prime. They're all overblown and stuff. They look to me like these sort of blowsy whores that are still like putting on the velvet and too much eyeliner even though they're past 40. And if you smell them, there's like this rich, sweet, lush scent with a little bit of decay under it. It's like, um, it's like the way New Orleans always used to smell to me before Katrina. <laughs> it's all good till somebody gets a bee up the nose. We're on our way to In-N-Out Burger, which is a West Coast sort of fast food place that has a secret menu. Like the real menu says hamburger, cheeseburger, but I've been coached and I know how to order the special things that aren't actually on the menu. So we're at the In-N-Out Burger. Super fun. I need a two by two, animal style, protein style, no tomato, no tomato, no pickles, no onions, no onions, no onions, no pickles, animal fries, small lemon up. Small lemon up. Also, the other thing about In-N-Out Burger is they pay more than minimum wage, so everybody who works there is like young and they look like they've been recently scrubbed down with salt and honey and fed on goat's milk. They're all shiny and cheerful. It's awesome. Wellness, unconditional love, uncompromising nutrition, holistic nutrition for your adult cat. This is what cat food looks like in California. In Georgia, it pretty much looks like prairie. San Francisco has an Alabama street. This is a very, very, very long line. And it's so people can get on this thing here, which is famous, and a cable car. Here goes, here goes. Everybody's going to lunch. It's faster than me. But not much. Jill is trying to make me say the name of this store, but I won't do it. Best meal I had in San Francisco, that would be Rivoli. It was so good, I got the chef to sign the menu. Here's the only thing we didn't eat, and I'm getting ready to eat it.